1998, playwright and activist Eve Ensler, who is most notably known for her play The Vagina Monologues, started the nonprofit V Day. The purpose of V Day is to raise money and awareness in support of organizations that aid female victims of violence and sexual abuse. V Day sponsors events every year on Valentine's Day. One Billion Rising is the name of the 15th anniversary of V Day. This event became a massive call to action sent across the globe for women to strike, dance, and rise. Choreographer Debbie Allen produced a dance routine with music by Tina Clark, which was used as a template for a worldwide flash mob on February 14, 2013, celebrating V-Day. The video of the dance routine went viral and people from more than 200 countries danced in their communities to break the chain of violence against women. This is what it looked like in Atlanta, Georgia, USA. I am Bernice A. King, and in the spirit of my father and mother, Martin Luther King Jr. and Coretta Scott King, I am rising. I wholeheartedly join in this international movement by urging people of goodwill everywhere to stand up, speak up, and never shut up until about violence towards females wherever and whenever it occurs. Today, I am rising because I believe that now is the time for people of all races, religions, cultures, and nations to rise up and declare their determination to eliminate violence in all of its forms towards women and girls and everybody. I'm rising for you. I'm rising for our city. I'm rising for the women and girls and men and boys who are at this very moment gathering and dancing and creating amazing change around the planet and they are with you here and you are with them. The violence is not diminishing, it's escalating. It's friggin' nuts. So we just have got to, you know, and I don't know about y'all, but I am pissed off. I am pissed off. And basically that's why I'm rising, because I'm pissed off. What I didn't even know, did y'all know that one in three women in this world, in their lifetime, will be brutalized or raped? That's unbelievable. And one in four girls in college will be date raped. You know, and now we're talking about young men and the need to educate young boys and change the culture of this world and start at the root of the problem. She is the breast that feeds the nation. She is the womb of salvation. Oh, the world is split, huh? Women will mend it. The world is broken, oh, women will fix it. Oh, light to the fire, the women have arrived. Let the doing, let the dance begin. Show, show my support for all the women around the world. And I want to say thank you to the men that are here because we were, yeah. We came this far because of your help, so thank you. And we need you to continue to support us to make the difference and stop the violence around the world. And I'm here to dance, so let's do it. I stand here this morning to let you know that domestic violence doesn't have a specific face. Our survivors and victims cover a broad spectrum of people, from the corporate CEO or businesswoman to the young girl or teenage girlfriend that's violated by the teenage boy. Doesn't it feel great to be a part of an international uprising, a billion voices strong? Can you feel that power? I mean, this is historic. This is a 
moment in history. This is a new high water mark for women and men of goodwill to come together and say we're in an international campaign. Today we speak to a world enraged, enraged in penetration cry, shouting, we have had enough violence against women. Women have been publicly and privately accosted all over the world, and today we stand in solidarity to speak against those kinds of atrocities. Hi, my name is Kylie Lewis, and I'm rising. <laughs> I'm rising because I live with one of those one in three. Um, experiencing your father beat your mother constantly and um, excuse me seeing someone be abused for the first time and watching the blood and the bruises and the black eyes and witnessing and hearing the screaming, the things being thrown. It's, it's horrifying. And it's scary. And coming home and everything being fine and everything being okay and happy and then everything switching in an instant is confusing. It's a never ending cycle of bleeding and bruising and beating and black eyes. And it needs to stop. And everybody, everybody, every single last person on this earth needs to stand up and we all need to rise together. Stop now! 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 Stop now!